Any team coverage tonight as teachers at the Capitol are encouraged to share their stories with lawmakers. But one key player was missing for the first day. Two Works for You reporter Micah Hatfield shows us where Governor Mary Fallon was for day two. One of the big concerns that teachers had after day one of the walkout was that Governor Mary Fallon never showed up to the state capitol. Several of them took pictures of her empty parking space and shared them on social media. President of the Oklahoma Education Association, Alicia Priest, tells me she's sure the governor is busy, but they're rallying whether she's there or not. And she's sure their chants could be heard at the governor's mansion. You can't ignore 30,000 people coming to the Capitol and um, telling you, pleading with you, We've got to do better for our kids. I know that teachers are creative, and so to let the governor know how we are feeling about her not being here, I witnessed sticky notes being put all over the door. We learned that Governor Fallon met with groups of teachers from Moore, Mustang, and Chisholm for about 10 minutes today, but she's not meeting with anyone else because she's too busy. Teachers will be back here tomorrow. They tell me the ball is in the legislator's court. In Oklahoma City, Micah Hatfield, Two Works for You.